Sanam guys, yeah, 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 yeah. Let's see what's gonna be happening. What we need now? Why do we need to be in a good energy today? Like, what do we have to celebrate today? Because I feel like we should be expecting something good. We should be expecting good vibes. Okay, we should be expecting downloads and gifts and monies and health and love. Do -do -do -do. The hand, man. There's definitely something. Um, I feel like uh, uh, hmm, I don't. It feels spiritual, but like I feel like something's about to happen that's gonna make you happy in a way of like maybe you're gonna be happy something else that didn't happen or you're gonna be happy uh that you had to wait or you're gonna be happy something like that okay one more the moon i feel like something very unexpected is about to happen for you something that you're not um I don't want to say not thinking of, like for some of you, you might be thinking of something specific, uh, but it's like going to come uh, out of nowhere or something like that. Okay, the Seven of Swords like showed itself pretty well there. I feel like some kind of meticulous planning. Let's see what's happening. We have passion. Trust and follow your renewed passion in your love, life and career. Okay. Being bound. Christ. And the Seven of Swords. So it's kind of giving this energy. It's almost like being bound due to desire or being bound um, due to either passion or an overthinking or over planning of things. So I feel like I feel like there's some kind of double edged sword energy here today. I feel like you're ha you're you're being gifted some kind of um opportunity something's about to happen that's going to allow you to either unbound yourself by choosing passion by choosing what you love by choosing um uh, almost like the path of least resistance your own personal path of least resistance right however i feel like you might be thinking that the boundness is due to some kind of throwing caution to the wind uh, consciousness or energy when in reality the boundness is actually um the 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 idea that you can't have everything you want the idea or the belief that you can't trust your passion okay for some of you, you might be in a situation of being bound because you followed your passions, because you, you kind of threw caution to the wind. And specifically, I'm getting for some of you in regards to either a person or a work situation, right? I feel like you do need to recognize, first of all, you're not really bound. But if you do feel yourself being feeling bound after throwing caution to the wind, it's because in some way you are actually maybe throwing caution to the wind from a very um, lack, from a, a very dense lack mentality. It was almost like maybe you were trying to force yourself into freedom. You get what I'm saying? Instead of just being free instead of just being liberated so i feel like <clears throat> i don't even want to say you have a choice in this regard because we are on the fast track to our highest we are on the fast track to um like proper liberation right like within ourselves so i feel like this is just a reminder okay when something feels too good to be true when something feels uh like it could be too much or um that it requires too much of you or that it requires a lot of um energy from you or something like that um that it's it's too dangerous or something like that um especially because of experiences you had in the past i want to say again that belief is false okay um if if you if you look back at how you manifested the situation
situation you're in. 444. Four, four. I guess you could say, yes, but I did everything correctly. But were you doing it from an actual liberated space? No. Otherwise, you would have manifested an actual liberated experience. Now, however, I feel like you are seeing this disillusionment. You are seeing how you have been uh, misleading yourself, manipulating yourself, how you have been, for some of you, maybe even keeping yourself stuck in victim consciousness or something like that, okay? And I feel like you are ready to fully unbind yourself by this time around actually doing something out of passion and love and not because you feel like you need to prove something to yourself or others, okay? This is the time. This is the this is the go around where you're actually about to be acting from love um, of life, okay? It's no longer going to be coming even from a smidget of um, lack mentality. And I feel like that's what you're, that's what's maybe very unexpected. I feel like you're going to be realizing that, oh, yes, I have been manifesting from lack, from some kind of trying to manipulate the universe into working for me kind of energy, where in actuality, um, you manipulating was the thing making you bound. You literally, literally just need to allow this rainbow, just allow your passion from a place of liberation. And I feel like that's what you're doing now. Okay, so congratulations. Thank you so much, Collective. And that was your reading. Please do the thing. And I will do the thing with you because we are in the thing together, I guess, right? I love you, bye.